If you want to know how to zoom in on Clipchamp, you've come to the right place. So firstly, of course, we need to put our audio or video inside of the timeline. And as you can see, now it looks like this. And what if we want to change it? Basically, do we have the option to zoom it in? Basically, uh, Clipchamp provides us the opportunity to interact with videos inside of the sun and we can easily zoom them in, but we cannot use so-called keyframes. All we can do here is just simply zoom, like make it bigger inside of the frame. So in order to do this, we just simply need to click on our video on the timeline. And after that, this green border will appear. And the same stuff here, it will be like marked this frame here. So after that, we can easily click on this corner or on this corner and then just resize the video into necessary position. So now, as you can see, it looks like this. After that, we need to change the position of the video so we can rotate it. Basically, we can place it anywhere we need. It helps us to centralize, as you can see, these purple lines here. So we can easily try to zoom it to the necessary position. For example, if you want to show this object inside. And basically, we can do it right like, like this, like this. There are a lot of options we can do, but make sure that there is no like these green or black parts inside of this sun while you are editing your video, while you are zooming. So basically, when everything is done, we can just simply click somewhere. And as you can see, it, was, it will be like deselected. And after that, uh, the zoom will be automatically added to our sun. As you can see, now it looks like this. And in order to make it easier, we can also zoom in the timeline. So we can find this button here, we can click on plus and the timeline will increase its size. So this is basically the way of how can we zoom in on a clip shop. Hope this video helped you out. If you have any questions, you can write them in the comments below. So our video is ready to be exported. Click on it here and then just choose the necessary quality. Hope this video helped you out. Goodbye.